everybody, I'm Michael Marie, and we're getting back into To The Moon, and everyone in the world has warned me that this is super sad, and that I'm going to cry. I don't know when, but that's a thing. So, what we're doing now is we've wandered around the home and whatnot, and now... Your helmet's on the couch. Chop, chop. Okay, alright, alright, alright. What couch? Oh. Probably. Initiate! I think we're jumping into his memories? All right, here we go. Yeah, I think that's what we're doing now, is we're actually jumping into his memories. He wants to go to the moon, as explained with the title. So our job is to get him to the moon, somehow. I don't really know how. Still haven't gotten that part figured out in my brain. Uh, he likes origami. This should be the last accessible memory. Disable speech for all except Johnny. Done. Let's get in. At any time you can view your position in time by moving the mouse toward the top of the screen. Oh. Okay. Okay, so... What I do about that? Oh yeah, so we got a origami rabbit and a platypus. That's it. Alright. Nothing change. What do I do now? Don't go downstairs. Okay, well that was a weird way of going downstairs. Hmm. I don't know. Okay. What I do? What do I do? Hey! I used to be able to go that way. It's all cloud. Um. Oh, we're okay. I get it now. I'm sorry. That took way too long in piecing together. Johnny? What a pleasant surprise. We don't get many visitors around here. My name is Dr. Eva Rosling, and this is Dr. Van Von Matterhorn. Dr. Lorenzo Von Matterhorn. Yes! How I met your mother reference. I like him again. Dr. Neil Watts. Thank you. Are you familiar with the Sigmund Agency of Life Generation? Oh, are you two from there? How convenient. Sorry, I should be much older and sound. How convenient. I've just been thinking of calling you. Lily, get us some tea, please. Da, da, da. Lily? Actually, you've already called us. Lily disappeared! This is magic! This is dark black magic if I've ever seen any. We're here to fulfill your contract from the relative future. Oh, wait! Careful there, if you slip off the cliff, we're gonna have to reload this memory. Watch it, Neil. Show some respect. Eh, it's just a program, you know? You know? I know, but this is his last accessible memory, and we need this. It's cooperation. Worst comes to worst, we can just reboot it. Why would you waste time like that? Exactly. That's not efficient. You! You are here to take me to the moon, aren't you? Yes, John. I suppose I had a good run. Not good enough, it seems. Oh my god! <laughs> Shut up, Neil! So, can you do it? Can you take me to the moon? 
We can't, but you might be able to. Why do you want to go there? I don't know. Most people have a reason as to why they want... Fuck it. It's fine. You can tell us it's essential for helping us to get you to go there. Do you want the fame? The money? You've got... You've got to have a motive. Any kind. Most people do. I just want to go to space. Space! Space is cool! Space is so cool! I'm sorry, but I really don't know. I can go to the ocean. I can't go to space. I want to go to space. Sorry, I'll keep on with the story. I'm sorry. I just do. I can already tell that this is going to be a pain in the ass. Thanks, Neil. Always the best. Nevertheless, Johnny, here's what we, we will do. We need to get to your childhood, but it is too distant to do so in one memory hop. Thus, we will need to tra traverse through your memories with gradual backward leaps, which you've given us the permission to do in the relative future. Once we lay down the waypoints in your childhood memories for direct access, we will return here. That's when you'll need to help us influence the childhood you to become an astronaut. Or to get on a giant catapult. Same thing. The point is, you'll need to have more to say than just, I don't know. As long as you can take me to the moon, I will cooperate in any way possible. Good. Okay. Why does he not know why he wants to go to the moon? Alright, I'm sorry. Now, in order to leap to memory, we need an item that is so is of importance to you. Do you have a memento of some sort to get us started? Oh. That'll do. That'll do, pig. That'll do. We, well, shall we? Ladies first! I'm a lady. Oh, now I can. Oh, no, 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 I clicked. Sorry, my bad. Received note moon. We'll need to prepare this moment this memento first. Okay. Ah, ah! We got all future on our ass. Alright, complete the memento. Click the orbs to flip the pieces. Okay. Oh I get it, I get it, I get it, I get it, I get it. Got it! Boom! I'm a smart! The memento can now be activated for Traverse. I know it was the first level mini game thing, but still I'm smart. Activate! Wait about my pri- Wait! What about my privacy? Well, try not to violate what we can avoid. <laughs> well, try not to violate what we can avoid. But in most cases, it can't be helped. We are, you know, plunging into your memories. You don't have any more privacy. You signed away privacy. What's with all the rabbits? They're weird. Oh, and there's the platypus on the piano. Paper rabbits, platypus, piano. I think he likes the letter P. The music's really pretty. Turn off visibility and interactivity. It'd be messy to be seen. Yeah, yeah. Happy. I am. Anytime this music's played, I like it. Jeez, what's with all these rabbits? This is creeping me out. We probably should have checked his record for psych psychopathy first. What the? Did he hear me? That's impossible. It's probably just a part of his memory. Bam. Then I stand by my point. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, quit blabbering and find a memento here to hop from. Um, is the plat pa 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 platypus one? I can't even get to the pup 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 platypus. 
A multicolored paper wrap. Well, aren't you special? Having two colors when all of your siblings look like they drowned in bleach. What's that? You think you're really creepy? Why, yes. I agree. Me too. Got a memory. I assume that's what that little orby thing was. I want the pop 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 platypus. Hey. I wanted to look at the flowers. Okay, we'll go upstairs. Would the umbrella be one? Hey, no, he's up here. What are you doing up here? An old and patched up backpack. What is this? A million years old? I guess we'll find out. God, that was helpful. So helpful. Don't. If we have to explain our presence to him at every memory, I'd go crazy. Don't tempt me. Okay. Fresh wild flowers. Okay, yeah, that was a memory. Totally. A glass bottle of pickled olives. <laughs> I hate this stuff. I don't like olives either. I hate olives. What's to hate? It's pickled olives. It's an olive. That's what's to hate. Um, I'm betting that umbrella was the last one. I would love... There we go. Umbrella. Okay, I'll just inject you with orbs. Like a normal person. What just happened? A selection of reading. I guess I just click on everything. No, just no. Still nothing. No, no. Moon. Description. Objective. To the moon and Johnny's memory is full. Okay. The clock is moving but soundless. Receive note. Clock. The clock is Johnny's house never ticks. Thanks. That was helpful. Super helpful. Do I shoot you with this orb? Pew! Need one more orb. Why do I have a feeling it's this platypus? clock is moving but soundless mm. the emperor's new clothes hey didn't we read that book was that a book in the last episode I think it was memory established I just spat like over everything what the fuck was that what that's it! I'm doing the breaking from now on! Okay. Memento, prepare! That was such a helpful partner. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh.
Aha! Ha! Yes! Boom! Got it! Got it! Activate! I wonder if I have like a set amount of turns I'm supposed to... Okay. Ah! Oh, we're time traveling! Through memories! When it comes to rain, though, it's better than on two. I don't mind it regardless. Seems like these memories hop only span a short period of time. We need to find a leaping memento or it's going to take forever. Meh, just enjoy the scenery. Okay. In memory of River E. Wiles. So I think that one's his wife. Tell you the platypus would be a memory. Honestly, I just don't think this animal has the right to exist. Platypus, you're cool. The world's not big enough for two of you. They're cool, guys. Platypus are cool. It's finished, River. What? Whoa, what? Like you, I'll be able to watch over her every day. She won't be alone anymore. Who? Who? I might never, I might never understand why, but I stayed true to your wish. I'm sure Anya is grateful to you too. Who's Anya? But when I'm gone, who is going to watch over us? Who are you? My name is Eva. I was just passing by. Was she your wife? Yeah. Her name was River. That's a special name. It didn't need to happen. Hmm? She... She didn't need to do it but she you wouldn't understand I don't even understand okay yeah just disappear or appear and disappear Hate to be the one who points out the obvious, but I know that um, Lighthouse has some major significance in this, but I don't know what yet. Note. Anya. Someone John and River cared for. That was really sad, and the music just really emphasizes it. I, who's Anya? About time you got here, I almost thought you fell off the cliff. What were you doing? Enjoying the scenery. What else? Any luck here? Big luck. Huge dinosaur. Feel like you're being sarcastic. Huh? This place looks pretty empty. It's a lighthouse. What do you expect? Idiot. Anyway, I'll catch you on the other side. Have fun re-breaking the barrier for yourself. You do sure. Alright, that's the thing. Broken lighthouse lamp. Why is he here? Is that all I got? All right, let me just shove this thing with all my balls. Pew, pew, pew. What happened? Who's on ya? Why did Watch just leave me? Easy. Ah. 
let's activate the platypus. P -p 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 platypus. Oh, is that River? And all the rabbits. And the piano's up here. Just enough. Just enough for what? After we pay for your operation, we'll have just enough left for it. So don't, so don't you worry. White lie. That's what you call it, right? No, I'm sure we can just stop it. I don't like it when you lie. I calculate our fan finances. I know how it's like. Why do you try to convince me against my will? We need the money for your medical bills, River. I understand that Anya means a lot to you, but this this is just too much. I mean, she she isn't even... Do you know what makes me happy, Johnny? What? Do you? Well, I do. I just hope you can help me with it. River! When the papers for my treatments get here, I will not sign them. What you do with our money is up to you. But if you would grant my wish, I want you to use it to finish building that house. And then, for every day that you live there, I want you to watch over her. Visit her, speak to her, comfort her. I don't want her to be alone anymore. And what about you? Happy. I'll be happy. Johnny? Yeah? I made this. It's the special bunny. Tell me what it is. Wh what? Just tell me what it is. The bunny's different than the others. It's a rabbit, like all the others you made. What else? Um, it's made of paper. What else? Its body is yellow and the rest is blue. Good. What else? This is some sort of trick. Look, River. I wrote a song. It's for you. Okay. Well, would you like to hear it? Yes. You don't have to bring the piano in here for this. I can hear you just fine with the door open. This is a sweet gesture. It's called For River. Why so cliche? It's just a placeholder. It's the song. This is sad. What is she? Why? Who is this Anya they were talking about? If she's so important, shouldn't we have seen her in his last or in his late memories? I guess he didn't keep that promise after all. Unless. Unless what? Never mind. Is it? I'll keep it. I'll keep what I think. Hey, that's the same song the kids were playing earlier, huh? I guess he taught them. You know what? I'm too manly for this. I'm heading on! Sorry. I should have read that more manly-like. I already got my memory links. You want to hitch a quick ride or look around yourself? I'm going to explore. Go on ahead. I'll catch up with you. 
Don't you miss the days when memory audio to MP8 conversion was legal? I think I bought a <laughs> I brought home over 2,000 songs during my first year on this job. He's doing this for all the wrong reasons. Or at least it seems that way. The Emperor... It's that book again. Alright, what's so important about the book? Book, platypus, rabbits, piano. Pretty sure lighthouse is one of those as well. Oh, not important this time. Paper rabbit. What river gave to John? These notes are really helpful. I love this song. I'm not even gonna read the note. Dumb note. It's gonna be like, it's the song that John wrote for River. I'm telling you, there's just no way. What if we take it apart? Look at us, John. We aren't exactly at the ripe age of piano moving. No one's ever at the ripe age of piano moving. You know what, if this means that much to you, I'll pay for the professionals to do this. I can't help saving that house for you, so this is the least I can do. Alright, so. That was really sweet. I mean, yeah, she can hear the piano, but it's just, it was a nice gesture. It was really sweet. Someone really likes these stupid olives. A pot of mixed dough. Why is that a memory? I guess, I mean, it's a thing, but maybe the smell smell is like smell inst like pfft, smells uh trigger the memory the best oh i think i have all the things i have all the memories where's the plants yeah it was the plants Pew, 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 pew. Alright. Prepare! We're just memory hopping all over the place. We're going all those sorts in his mind. Okay. If we do that one. No, wait. These are hard for me, okay? Damn it! I'm not good at these. I needed to use the, the diagonal. I'll get better. I hope that doesn't like affect anything. But my badness of it. Activate the plant. There's so much that's happened. I can't even process. So who is she? She's risking her life. Like she's clearly on her deathbed. So what is it for? Because I don't think he's the kind of jerk. Bounce, bounce, bounce. I don't think he's the kind of jerk to just... Hey, look what we have here. Oh, is this the house near the lighthouse? Yeah. Anyway, so... Yeah, he's not the jerk who would just like... Be like, oh, no, I'm not going to do it. So what was it? I bet they saw this cliff and thought it was not dangerous enough without people living on it. I know how to do this. Nick called and I said and said I should come.
I brought you pickled olives. They're your favorite, right? God damn those things. You're ruining the moment, olives. I heard about River. Will she be okay? Her illness was just diagnosed in its late stage. Fortunately, it's treatable. But the medical bills... What does she have? We can't afford to finish building this house, Isabel. We can barely afford to pay for her treatment. I'm just relieved that she'll be okay, but... You don't know how much this place means to her. No, I know. She's going to be heartbroken. I'd help, but Ted and I have barely getting by since the market crashed. What are you going to do now? I'm... I'm going to tell her that we can't make it. I'm going to tell her that we can't afford everything. I don't want her to do anything crazy. You shouldn't lie to her. You don't understand, Isabel. If she found out, I'm not sure which she'd choose. So what? If she chooses not to save herself for the sake of this place, then so be it. It's what she really wants. I really dislike when your neurotypicals think you know what's best for others. I hate when you call me that, Izzy. Do you think this is all about her? What about me, Isabel? After all these years, am I not allowed to be selfish even once? I don't want to be alone, Isabel. I'm not going to let her die. That's arrogant. I don't care. Where are you going? I'm going to pick something from this cliff to bring back to her. It'll at least give her some comfort. That doesn't make what you're doing any less wrong. Nick wanted me to give you this. He said it's called Everything's Alright. It isn't. Uh, I'm actually I'm going to end it here. I'll put a little bit of my thoughts into it, and then I'm. But this is where I'm ending. Ending it. <laughs> if I can say words, sorry guys. Um, I think I think Anya is the lighthouse. I think that is my theory because why else would they be building the house there? I don't know what the connection is with the lighthouse, but I'm fairly confident that it is the lighthouse that they're talking about but it has to be something big also the paper rabbit the yellow and blue one has to have a bigger meaning to it because she pushed a lot on it but what john is doing and what john is saying i i can't blame him for it i can't blame him for thinking that way for because he knows we know because we interacted we saw and we witnessed her choose anya and the money for this house over her own health and her own life. So we know, but he knows that she's going to pick that before he even does anything. And I can't blame him for wanting to lie to her. Because being alone is scary. Yes, it's incredibly selfish, but it's scary too. So I can't blame him. Uh, I I love this game. I, I'm excited to see where it goes and what's taking it. It's such a weird experience because you're going through all these memories. So you know what's going to happen in the end because you already lived the ending. But seeing how a story goes through backwards is incredibly interesting to me. And I'm really excited with what's going to go on here, what's going to happen. Um, so if you like what you saw, like, comment, subscribe, all the fun stuff and all the fun places. And until next time, I'll be seeing you guys. Bye!